So, as a little recap from yesterday's stream, um, we are some person of indeterminate age and gender. I think we're in our 40s now because we started working presumably somewhere in our 20s. And uh, it's been about 15 years. <clears throat> 15 years at this company. We've got promoted once in 15 years. Um, we slept with our ex. She got married. We haven't heard from her since. Um, another one of our coworkers set us up with somebody else, and we've been with her for a long time. Uh, we have a daughter. We uh, once worked overtime and forgot to pick up our daughter from school. <clears throat> and... Um, Presumably our daughter is older now, maybe like 10, I'm not sure. We have uh, some gold coins from that overtime. Uh, about 10 years since the ex got married, that sounds about right, yep. I wish we'd update, because we were friends even after the breakup. Uh, we left on pretty good terms, our brother's a bit of a loser. Um, he's always making bad decisions and uh, trying to get money from us, but we don't give it to him because we're a jerk. Um, it's a good thing my brothers don't do this to me, otherwise I'd be a jerk too. Hey, dork, and uh, what what else? <clears throat> we waited six years to talk uh, talk to the CEO of our company, and when we did, he uh, basically it was basically just automatically generated responses. We would ask him questions, and he would respond to completely other questions. Um, the company has now since installed. Um, a progress monitoring software on our computer or focus monitoring software on our PCs <clears throat> which coincidentally seems to have um, prevented us from being able to type anything negative about the CEO every time we try to talk about our CEO uh, the message gets changed to something adoring something positive so that's interesting as well. Uh, let's see, any other any other main points that I've missed? I think that's the... We've had the same supervisor for 15 years. And uh, he's getting ready to retire. <clears throat> and yeah, we're miserable. That's the, uh, that's the summary of this game. <laughs> so without further ado, let's jump into day two. Of day repeat day. Oh, is that why my rating in the company went down? <sighs> cause I, cause I'm being honest. Uh, <laughs> Sounds like an IRL company. Yeah, that's why it's depressing. <laughs> Hello, my name is Charlie. You wait a minute, guys. Remember how our supervisor was talking about how eventually his job's going to become automated and he's planning on retiring soon? Do you guys think that's what happened? Do you think you're retired and now we're talking to a computer? I mean, literally, this is a video game. Yes, I'm talking to a computer. But in the world of the video game... You must be here for today's task list. How wonderful. Uh, do I need to call the doctor, old man? What's wrong? Oh, what's wrong is that my cat doesn't like her. <laughs> yeah, I'm streaming. I'm not just talking to myself. Oh, you might be thinking of the good old human Charlie. Here it is. The new Charlie is an advanced AI interface to your working day. Don't worry, the new Charlie is fully prepared to perform all operations as required, same as before. Where's the real Charlie? Unfortunately, we had to let good old Charlie go. You fired him? 
He, he wasn't ready to retire. He didn't have his house paid off yet, and he didn't have the money to retire. Uh, we prefer to say good old Charlie left to pursue other opportunities. He did fire him. Let's not get stuck on technicalities. Good old Charlie is now in a happy place. All right, why do you call yourself Charlie? We always get named after the people we help move on. <laughs> what? <laughs> oh, weird. A familiar name on your screen will inspire you to reach your goals and bring a smile on your face. All right, shut up and give me the list. Oh, so you're an eager beaver. That's what Charlie likes to see. <laughs> Say no more. There you go. Your task list is ready. Contact Charlie after the tasks have been done. Have a pleasant day. I hate new Charlie. Give me old Charlie. All right, Richard. Let's talk. Wait, we already, this is the same as before. I never thought I'd get through. Of course you get through, you're my friend. We have bonded over deeply interesting conversations and wildly satisfying debates, remember? What's on your mind? This guy's an AI too. <laughs> How old are you anyway? Shouldn't you be retiring now? <laughs> I'm only about 80, or was it 90, or I can't remember. That's old. <laughs> Age is just a number. All these life extending treatments and therapies make me feel like I'm 20. You too should be taking them. They're the best. I don't know. Oh wait, there's a possibility that they're only available to me because I'm filthy rich. Yeah, that's it. That might be why I keep seeing so many old people. Another mystery solved by my ultra-efficient brain matter. Anything else you're curious about? How do you justify running all these questionable ventures? <laughs> I'll ask him about his private prisons. I see myself as a protector of humanity. Putting bad people away cannot in any way be considered questionable. It's a wonderful business opportunity as well. All right, you've convinced me, man. Like our family motto says, if it's legal, how can it be wrong? I don't know what to say to that. What's up, Tangy? <laughs> I'm out. Bye-bye. Alright, let's do the thing. As Tangy commands. Oh, so these ones are real fragile. We just need the diamonds. Solo los diamantes. I was not expecting it. You surprised me good. Gave me a little, uh... surprise a -roo. Wait, only three moves left. But I wasn't even paying attention. Maybe that's the problem. If I switch these, these drop three. One, two, three. Oh, that's too far. Oh, wait. I can just kill it this way. Boom. We can talk to Charlie again? I just talked to the founder again, and have you noticed he seems to have a few screws loose? He's probably an AI too, guys. Praise be Richard Richmond Jr. He's the one who took us in and opened our eyes. He's the light that guides us. The almighty miracle worker. All right, am I in a cult? I thought it was a company. 
Uh, which re which response should we type? I am eternally thankful. Amen. <laughs> this can't be legal. Uh. All right, let's try to open this place up. Open it up. Yellows and reds. This one's not gonna work. This is not a dub, guys. This is an L. It's not going to be as far off as I thought it was going to be, though. But it definitely is an L. Failed. Failed my task. Yellows and reds priority. Exploding blocks is second priority. All right, that wasn't bad. Um. Oh, I can't switch it with anything, huh? this time. to kill those ones unless I do something higher up like this first. That's actually pretty interesting. We can probably talk to Jules about this, about how we can't talk about our CEO. Hello, friend. It was great to see you and Viv's pretty face at the FTM event. What's FTM, guys? All 
All right. I don't think that's what she's referring to. Yeah. That's what I was thinking too, but probably not this. Um, when's the next one? We need more jewels in our life. These things come and go, as you know. I'll let you know, of course. Anyway, the same your shame you're still stuck at Jokey Jokey, but be as it may, I need you for something. One project we're currently funding through the foundation is looking into certain shady business practices at multinational companies. You want me to be a spy? Yeah, those are good ideas, guys. I think that's likely. It's headed by this journalist friend of mine, and they're looking for someone. In, someone, they're looking for someone insight in how companies like Jokey Jokey operate. Can you help us? Wow, dude. Ooh, we're going undercover. We literally have software on our computer that's changing our messages. Somehow, I don't think I'm going to be able to get away with this. But what are they going to do? Fire me? Sure. Kill me? Hopefully not. Replace me with a computer? 555-9925. Leslie. They fire, fired Charlie, by the way. After 20 years or whatever. He did get replaced by an AI. But I mean, it's hard to demonize a company for replacing a, a silly job with an AI, right? Maybe they gave Charlie a good severance package, or maybe not, I don't know. My daughter deserves an AI caretaker. Yo, I'm, I'm not a great guy. Yeah, the CEO is totally an AI, right? They probably didn't. Yeah, you're right, dork. That's what companies are supposed to do, make a profit. I hope you told Charlie that. <laughs> These are all kind of terrible responses. Get over yourself, a tool's a tool. You're as much as a tool as a computer. <laughs> They're just cheaper. <laughs> oh, man. I have a family support. What am I supposed to do? Oh, my goodness. She is mad. I just moved boxes. Bye. I will talk to Leslie later. Let's do another job before we go into super spy mode. All right, we need to get down there. So fast. Yeah, I'm gonna get a promotion from that one. Maybe not. Hi, right, Leslie. Hello. Hello, and who are you? You can call me X. A friend gave me your number. I 
work for Jogi Jogi heard you were interested. Serious allegations against my company? I'm on my company computer. This is stupid. They literally know when I'm talking about my CEO. No, this is the in-game music. It's nice. What kind of allegations we talking about? <laughs> Human rights violations with terrible working conditions, tax evasion? Oh man. I don't know anything though. Let us worry about that, okay. What employee level are you? I'm level one. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I've only got one promotion. If you can get promotions. Yeah, I've been trying. <laughs> Ask for a promotion today. All right. Okay. Oh, we used to be able to talk to Richard. It went away. I want a promotion, Charlie. AI, Charlie. This sounds like Dork's boss. <laughs> <laughs> Never mind. <laughs> that was too easy. <laughs> You're a real go-getter. <laughs> That's what Charlie likes to see. We did it. It took 15 years. And then we just asked and we got another promotion. I got the promotion. There you go. Keep it up. Hey, I want another one. Expert. I was a packer and then a senior packer. I'm an expert senior packer, dude. We are moving up in the world, guys. Wait. We're moving. We First, we were shipping fruit and then we were shipping gems. Now we're shipping lions and elephants. Is, is that legal? <laughs> I guess that's the point. Um, yeah, what the heck are these fish? Killing the animals, we're shipping them. We ship things through match three games. All right, fish and elephants. We're supposed to ship fish and ele elephants. Everything else is secondary. And if we can, if we can kill these blocks, that'd be nice. Yeah, seriously, Goonzy. Yeah, we're... We're a bad father. We're a bad employee. We're a bad human being. We got no morals. fish and them elephants. I was a real go-getter. AI Charlie. 
understands my capabilities, all right? I need more fish. Great. Ugh, oh, it's Danny again. Hey, what's up? What do you want now? <laughs> I just wanted to say hello, you know, no need to be rude, but I see I'm not missed. Never mind. <laughs> he literally has only asked me for money. What if we said, what do you want? And he was gonna, what if this is gonna be a real conversation? We shot him down. What if he was gonna tell us about like our mom or something? Danny, you, you treated me like crap for 15 years. You deserve this, but maybe I should be merciful. I'm a terrible, I'm a terrible brother. All right, so we got a rocket, the thing on the bottom or something. at the four corners oh or get these magic bombs you don't uh, you don't like the you don't like the fish Never hesitate to contact your supervisor with any problems you have in life. Definitely not fish. All right, what is this supposed to be? Come on. What is that supposed to be if it's not a fish? Cucumber? What? <laughs> In tarnation? What in tarnation are you folk going on about? Explode the, the fish over here. We need to open this thing up and then get it to a fish. It's gonna be hard. Oh wait, I thought that was gonna do it for me. Or get this one to a fish. How do I do that? Like this, right? Easy. Oh, it's my wife. I don't know if we actually married, but... Hey, the agent called that we have until the end of the day to make an offer or the house with the garden is gone. Oh, we're buying a house. This is finally something I can relate to. Um... Oh, we have two daughters. Those are cute names. Lily and Amelie. What about the small loft? There's no rush on that one, but we need to make the choice now. Um. Let 
house with the garden or the one with the loft? We should have asked about our kids. What do our kids like? What do you guys think? Lofts are awesome. Gardens are a lot of work. I'm not going to be I'm not going to be doing anything with the garden. You think this guy is going to take care of a garden when he gets home? Whatever makes you happy seems like the wrong the wrong answer. She doesn't want that, right? She's asking my opinion. If someone asks your opinion, you shouldn't just throw it back to them and say whatever you want. I mean, what kind of market are we in? Are we in the market I bought my house in? In which case, make an offer on both of them because you're probably not going to get either. But if we're in a easier easier market to buy in, then uh, let's get the one with the loft. You think we can afford that? Why why are we making an offer on a house we can't afford? Yeah, uh, right. You might be right. I'm going to lose my job. <laughs> I'm going to get fired. Because <laughs> I'm trying to be a hero. Yeah, 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 you're right. No, I'm not going to take care of the garden. Why are we... Why are we... <laughs> what kind of a couple are we? We're making... We're interested in a house with a garden that I'm not going to take care of. And we're interested in a house that I can't afford. It's going to need a lot of work before it's safe for our daughters. This guy, like, I would like to say that I'm going to take care of it, but I know this guy is not going to take care of it. I thought we'd take care of it together. I have no interest in Garden. <laughs> Why are we buying that house? <laughs> we can't flip flop this many times. <laughs> All right, I need to name our player character. To name our player character, Jeff. Jeff, don't muck it up. I'll take care of the garden. What? What? <laughs> what the heck just happened? <laughs> Where did that come from? Wh which house do you want? She says, which house do you want? I say the loft. She says, isn't that expensive? I say the garden. She says, are you going to take care of it? And I said, sure, I'll take care of it. Oh, I thought this was still up for discussion. What? <laughs> <laughs> I can't, guys. I can't. I don't know what's going on at home, but it doesn't look like it's going well. <laughs> Is it, Christy? Um, I'm going to just be honest. I'm kind of blindsided here. I thought, I thought we were having a discussion. Um, this is not a nice thing to say. This isn't about the house, is it? <laughs> oh man, I'm sorry, Vivian. I'm sorry, Viv. Oh, man. Robin! Robin! Thank goodness. She got married 10 years ago. We haven't heard from her since. Robin, I need you. I need your help. But not sex, Robin. That's not what I'm looking for. Uh, let's not text her yet. Let's, oh, we're almost done for the day. Let's text her before we get done with work. I was just thinking about you the other day. 
What are you up to in a while? I haven't heard from you for a while. <laughs> Wait, I'm not single. <laughs> we can we can lie to our ex and say we're single. You do this and you're trying to cheat or what? <laughs> <laughs> I, I'm really tempted because I'm curious. Doesn't sound like my relationship's got more, much more left in it. But doing it for the kids, though. Doing it for the kids. Uh, still with Viv. Kids are growing up too fast. Happy for you, and I really mean it. You two are always a much better match than we ever were. Is this, is this bad, guys? Is this a bad thing to say to your ex? We had some good times. <laughs> well, actually, this, this is worse. Hey, Ritual, I've got a big crush on Robin from Stardew. That's my headcanon. This is, <laughs> yeah, both are suspicious for sure. I think this one's less suspicious. We had good times. We like it agrees, yeah. We weren't a great match, but you know, it wasn't all bad. <laughs> we had some good times. Yeah, the best of times. Anyhow. I'm the new design director at a bit of red now. Have you seen the new Max Iron Pants ads? Oh, she's still doing ad stuff? She got into the ad, doing art for ads. She art, art was always her passion. She got into doing art for ads um, to get her foot in the door, which I was happy for her for, but I don't know, 10 years later, kind of sucks that she's still stuck in the industry. But look at me 15 years later. I'm still working for Jokey Jokey. Um, I'm gonna be on it. I don't know, is this too negative? I don't think this is no we have we guys we haven't talked to her in like 10 years we shouldn't we shouldn't start up the conversation by being a jerk we should be at least a little positive for a little bit we don't we don't have the rep to tell her what we think like if you just tell some random stranger that they suck or that they're shilling or something they're just gonna be like all right screw you and then walk away um but uh like, you have to get rapport with someone before you can be a jerk. All right, uh, congratulations. Exactly, Christy. Yeah. I knew they were getting divorced. They only knew each other two months. I'm not saying that everyone who gets married after two months uh, it gets divorced, but I knew the game was going to have them get divorced. <laughs> I knew it wasn't going to last. This, you can really play such a jerk character. I'm kind of curious what that looks like. It's too painful. I'm trying to, no guys, we're not going to, we're going to, I'm not going to get back with our ex. Think about the kids. Think about Vivian. It's a bad combination though, when you have a fight with your wife and then immediately start texting your ex. <laughs> that's, that's not good guys. <laughs> we are not good. We are not good people in this video game. Um, <laughs> don't try this at home, kids. <laughs> All right. I mean, these are all terrible responses. First off, this is the worst. I knew it wasn't going to last. That's terrible. Why didn't I know this is so entitled? We haven't talked in like 10 years. How did it happen is also bad, but maybe it's less bad. I mean, it, I mean, it's every, lots of people break up. Um... Uh, 
Hey, that does sound familiar. <laughs> no regrets. Yeah, it's pretty familiar, actually. Why did we ever lose touch anyway? Would you say no to a little bit of reminiscing? <laughs> It's not inherently dangerous, guys. <laughs> Maybe it's just gonna be a nice platonic hangout between two old friends. <laughs> oh no. If I, if I could have control, if I could have control about what this player character did at this hangout, I'd probably do it. But I know this guy's just gonna sleep with her. <laughs> Sorry, honey, I couldn't pick up our daughter. I was bu busy having sex with my ex-girlfriend. <laughs> we can't do it. We can't do it. This, by the way, is a real pansy response. Like this is, this is weak and wimpy. I want to say this, but I, I don't trust the character. I trust myself. I don't trust my character, though. This is blaming it on someone else. No backbone when... when. Yeah, th this, is, this, is a, this is a slimy response. Like, real slimy. Don't blame... Unless you get permission from your partner. Now, sometimes in relationships, right? You, you, you say your part... You t talk to your partner and say, hey... This person's inviting me out. Can I use you as an excuse or something? You know, sometimes they'll be like, yeah, yeah, use me as an excuse. I got you. But if you use your partner as an excuse without telling them, that's so weak. We have to do this, guys. This, I don't want to, and this is really sad, but uh, we got to take care of ourselves and, and take care of our, our family and our daughters, so... It's really hard for me to do this. I still got a crush on Robin. Uh, and I want to see her again. But, uh, oh, Rip Tingy. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, Robin. Uh, are you really saying no? <laughs> <laughs> I guess there's no harm in just us having sex. You know what would happen. <laughs> By the way, this is also kind of a bad response. Even mentioning the possibility of what would happen starts like, it starts you down a path, you know? It starts you down a path of, of both thinking about it at the same time and... We can't. You... <laughs> I can't, I can't stay off of you, Robin. That's it then? That's a shame. I always thought we'd end up together. Despite everything, I guess not. Bye. <laughs> ah! We made the right call. Tell me we made the right call. If this happened IRL, I would text all my friends and say, hey guys, I just turned down this opportunity and I feel really bad about it. <laughs> and they'd be like, yeah, that sucks. But good job, dude. Good job. But I wouldn't be happy about it. Oh my goodness. <laughs> this is sad. <laughs> this is sad. I just lost lost my chance with with my with my big crush. I I've been into Robin this whole time, my character and me. But we're in a committed relationship, and uh, also, by the way, by the way, if Vivian breaks up with me. Because she's really mad. Like, that came out of nowhere with the house thing. If Vivian breaks up with me, and then I want to hang out with Robin, do you think she's going to ignore me? Like, also, why is she mad? 
I'm not saying that I don't want to. I'm saying I'm in a relationship and I don't trust ourselves to be alone right now because we're really into each other. She's got to respect that, right? Like, if you don't respect that, you're, you're a piece of garbage too, right? Like, you have to respect that. I don't know. Let's get back to work. All right, we need to kill the elephants. There's a bunch of elephants up top. If we can get up top, man, that was a lot of time. That was a roller coaster of emotions back there, actually. Um. Wow. Oh, but we can't actually explode any of these without the stuff down bottom. Goodness, getting all emotional now. Yesterday, it was because of this game specifically, I had a kind of emotional day. Yeah, let's do a survey on what the purple thing is. I knew, I knew, I, I was pretty sure reading the description of this game, that this game would mess me up. It looks like it's delivering. Just like Florence. Like some games, it's just kind of emotional and just by playing them, it just gets you in this mood. Florence is a good game. Really good game. All right, just gotta clear things out so we can get more elephants at this point. I honestly don't think Florence would have had such a impact on me if I weren't divorced, but I think that was part, probably a big part of it. Alright, Charlie, time to go home. We're gonna have a talk with Vivian about the house. I'd say there's an 80% chance that we're divorced in the next in-game day. What do you what do you guys think? Alright, Charlie, I'm done. How did it go? So for 14 years we've been honest with this company. For 14 years, we've had trouble being promoted. And now we're helping our old friend try to get dirt on this company. Now we're trying to get promoted. Now we're trying to make a difference. And to make a difference, it's time for us to dial up the corporate BS. We didn't want to be inauthentic before, but now we have to dial up the BS for a good cause. To get that promotion, to get the dirt, to make a difference. We're rank 532k, but I love my job. You're one lively fellow, he says. And my ranking didn't change. I'm truly living the dream here. Make sure to get a proper rest and we'll be ready to go tomorrow. I'm ecstatic, beyond happy, and I'm likely to explode from joy. I hope AIs can't detect sarcasm, because this is, I'm laying it on a bit thick. No, we got caught. We got caught. <laughs> oh, no. 
I was trying to suck up, not not lay it on that thick. We need a we need a jokey jokey therapist. I think we have to say yes, right? If if we want to suck up to the company, we gotta say yes. Okay, do it. Therapy tomorrow with a, a brainwashing corporate psychologist. My name is Charlie and I'm your therapist for today. Wait, what? <laughs> Charlie is fully certified for acting as an AI therapist. Are you feeling down? Uh, no. And how do you feel about not feeling down? I'm perfectly happy with that. And how do you feel about that? Good? Huh. Great session. Keep meditating on these feelings. Keep working hard. They say work is the best medicine. Who says that? Overtime work? I can't work overtime. I'm supposed to go home and have a fight with my wife. <laughs> I can't, Charlie. I got stuff to do. I can't. I can't. Like, e the the whole the only reason I would would be to 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 make a difference to to climb the rank so I could uh, help with the espionage. But I'm not making a difference if I ditch my wife when she's already angry with me. <laughs> no overtime for me today. Charlie's here to surf. Why don't you do it, Charlie? Because of your antisocial behavior, I've now booked 64 meetings with a therapist to work out these issues you have with doing the best you can. Antisocial behavior? What? what? Is not wanting to work... Isn't that social? Not wanting to work is... Alright, screw you, Charlie. AI Charlie, I'm out. Can I text real Charlie again? Can you still improve? All right, we got to say yes for the BS, guys. Yes, I can still improve. Ah, uh, Robin reported me. Yeah. Did you meet your own expectations? Yes. Does life feel like an illusion? Uh, that's kind of a weird question for a, a company questionnaire. No? Am, am I an AI? <laughs> am I a computer? I'm only at work. I'm only texting. I don't have a voice. Am I not real? <laughs> Alright, time for more dreams. Hashtag calm37, you can't see it. Yeah, I might not be real either, guys. You know, they said at the very beginning of this game that a machine could do my job. What if I am the machine that's doing my job? And that's why I can't type certain things. It's against my programming. Day 10,229? 28 years? Wait. That's too much. That's like 14 years after the last day. 
My kids are adults. I'm old. I'm close to retirement. What what happened with my wife? What happened with my espionage? What happened with my job? We've been we work here our entire life. Message of the day. A bouncy castle has been installed into the lounge area. Productivity studies have indicated that this is the top request among professionals to improve workplace culture. Have a bombastic day. My employee contract renegotiations are finished. What's the result? Congratulations are in order. You're no longer a mere employee. You're an independent contractor. Wait, that... Wait, that could be worse. My rank went up. Because then they don't have to fire me. Then they can just not give me work. Am I fired? Wait, you fired the last guy. What does that even mean? You can not work as much as you want. You need to buy your own computer. How does this affect my work? Customers can give you star ratings. Oh, what about healthcare? It's probably gone. Uh, it's, you don't have healthcare anymore. You get the same salary, just with none of the benefits. All you have to do to quit is just don't show up. That sounds magnificent. Great. Should we text Richard? Guys, Richard's like a hundred years old now. Or an AI. How to make cheap tanks everywhere available to everyone, like like fish tanks? Or like boom boom tanks. Augmented reality into your toothbrush. Making people think better about him. Plebeians. He's calling me a blub. Well, let's get to work. Um, we're not employed anymore. I don't know how we're going to pay for the kids. Wait, their kids are probably out of college now. They're probably in their 20s. I hope I'm still married. Or maybe I don't. I don't know. All right, we need to explode these boxes on the side. I don't know how we're going to do that, though. Would this help? I don't think so. Okay. We're making it. Kids are going to support me. Eh, I don't know. 
Hope the kids don't turn out like their uncle. Everything's diagonal. Um. All right, we did it. <sighs> oh, speaking of Uncle Danny, here he is. Yo, it's Danny. Hey, hey. Much love to you from the town of your origins. Like our old hunting grounds, you know? I hope you're not drunk again. <laughs> you know what? Guys, we're old. How are you, Danny? I'm totally medium well. Like, I'm surfing the waves of the universe and I'm trying to feel the vibes. But the universe is like totally bringing me down. Oh yeah, why is that, Danny? Well, no, it's the vibes. They've changed. It's not the same anymore. Hey, can I have a 20? Remember when we were like kids? We used to go to the woods and build our treehouse. Good times. The Mirador base, the last remaining defense of Barander City. I wonder if it's still there. Us two against the evil of the world. I miss that. Wait, he actually is being a normal brother? Why does everything I touch have to turn it? Oh. Oh, he's raised a great kid? Nice. I haven't seen him in three months. Oh. You got sober before. You can do it again, Danny. Dude, this is Danny, Danny V2. I feel better about everything. Huh. It doesn't mean you should just get up, buddy. Give up. What do you want, Danny? You want more? What do you want more of? Just enjoy the life you're given, Danny. Yeah. Oh, it's Vivian. We're still together, maybe. Unless she's going to be like, hey, pick up your stuff from 15 years ago. <laughs> oh. Hey. Watch out. He's drunk. All right. She's going to listen to my brother. Uh, she's uh, she's nicer, nicer than I am. We'll try to be nice. You just need someone to borrow money for you. All right, we need to get those lions. All right, let's uh, connect all of these. Good talk, Vivian. Nice to know my relationship is flourishing. My wife and I only have the best of talks. Oh yeah, we're supposed to be shipping lions, by the way. We are old, guys. We are old. We have not accomplished very much. But maybe this will be our time to shine. Maybe we will be able to make a difference. Let's 
see how our we'll we'll probably get an update soon about our uh, our espionage success. Um. One more, one more lion. One more lion. I didn't even see that I killed one. Wait, hold on. New chat from Jules. She's old too, I think. Hey, sorry about yesterday. I was in a bad mood. Again. Are you okay? What happened? She's not doing okay? <laughs> Wait. She stole this, sold a startup. She was so rich. She started... She joined this thing and tried to take down take down the man I became an expert senior packer thanks to her and she's shutting it down what happened to the projects what happened to making a difference that's a shame going on what happened I feel like I missed 14 years because I did you don't have to save the whole world Jules that's life <laughs> Jules why are you being like this everyone's so sad texting me at work today I can't deal with your nonsense. I'm going to get back to work. I'll text you later, Jules. Come on. She's probably drunk, too. I don't have the... I don't have the headspace for that nonsense. We're trying to kill elephants here. Sorry. Shit. Elephants. I don't see any elephants. Literally none. Maybe they're all down there. killed no elephants I think don't worry we're getting there Um. 
don't think we're going to do it. I wanted to save that for the elephants, but I don't think I could. Yeah, this one. This one's going to be a bit annoying, I think. Got kind of close. Yeah, so we just got to get to the bottom row. We got it. All right. Are you over yourself yet, Jules? No, she's not. You know what? I, I don't have patience with you anymore, Jules. I just have fun, whatever. Who cares? She's been hanging out with Danny too much. Oh, she's making fun of me. Never mind. You need a vacation. How can I when I look at the state of the world? Oh my goodness. The president has an official sponsor now. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> Dude, I'm really sick of you, Jules. Well then, if you want to keep fighting, keep fighting, but stop complaining. Get to get to work. You should ask Leslie about what happened to the project I was working on. I don't need your ranting. You're right. Wait. I sucked up to people for that project. It better did something. You know, let's let's have let let's meet in person. I don't think I'm going to have sex with her. Hey, what happened to the project we were working on, Leslie? We were getting to a point where we thought we had something real, something to publish. The editor calls me and tells me to pull the plug. So there was something. So then what? They destroyed all the material. What's the real story? The publisher of her newspaper got bought. 
Oh. Oh. The story got shut down by my own company. Just to bury the one bury the one story. Oof. Why not publish it somewhere else? So what did you do? You quit. But it didn't do anything. Uh, good for you. <laughs> to work things are getting things are getting wild back to these cuties Shipping some more cuties. I want another promotion. I asked only once in the last 15 years. Why didn't I ask again? It's these four up here, huh? What a cute game, yeah. <laughs> nice and cute. Wait, where's the match? Now just these two over here. Now just this one up here. How you doing, Winjo? Should be able to break it out in time. Yep, there it is. Yeah, we, we were being too sarcastic. <sighs> hey, don't be late today. Uh, why? <laughs> What's my schedule like today, Vivian? Did our mom die? Oh, it's worse than that. <laughs> What was it tonight? Funny. Unless you're serious, I can never tell. Guys, I'm in an unhappy relationship. <laughs> You'd be late for your own funeral if it was up to you, let alone Lily's my daughter's going away party. Be here by six. She's going to college. Wait, I thought she was in her 20s. Well, I mean, you can go to college in your 20s. No, Dork's joking. There's no mention of our mom. Actually, there was mention of our mother at the very start of this game. Uh, our, our loser brother, I wouldn't give him money, so he went to ask our mom for money. That's the only, that's the only mention of our mother this entire game, I think. Alright, our daughter's going to college. Dude, I think I'm like almost 60. Maybe we had kids late in life, I don't know. Finally, some peace and quiet. It's all too soon, I can't handle it. 
when our other daughter's in high school. Oh, okay. We'll figure it out. I'm trying to be a good husband. Partner. I don't actually know if we're married. Uh, we still have plenty of memories to make, Vivian. Come on, we're not dead yet. Don't you feel like we should have done more? Tried harder? Yeah, sure, everyone does, right? I am Coomzy. I've gotten promoted twice. I've worked for this company almost 30 years and I'm still packing. <laughs> oh no. Just don't be late. I don't want to talk to either of these people. I'm going to be honest, guys. Let's get back to work. All right. So we just need to break through the boxes to get to the animals on the outside, it looks like. Our daughter is going off to college tonight. Huh, so nothing happened, by the way. Yeah, this is our work. We're a packer. We ship animals. We ship animals by doing this. We used to ship fruit, and then we ship gems, and now we ship illegal animals, I think. Uh, our, I thought we were going to have a fight with our wife, but maybe we saved it. Maybe we saved our relationship with our wife because we didn't go out with our ex. I really liked the ex too, but uh, it seemed like a bad decision when we were buying a house and I had two daughters and a family. This guy is a bit of a slime ball. Um, but we were good, we were a good boy. these up I'm not exactly sure I don't I don't think the the shipping method uh, really works perfectly in terms of understanding the uh, mechanics of what's going on but it's something like this they 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 did a hand wavy explanation at the start Oh, I went the wrong way there. I don't think we're going to be able to beat this, guys. Not on this one. Ooh. There is only those two at the bottom, which we actually can get right here. We did it. What if we just go through these? Jewels, I'm a contractor. That's beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. It's fine. I just want to let you know. So we, 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 we basically, we're not an employee anymore. They're giving us the same take home, but no benefits. And they can fire us whenever they want because we're not technically an employee. We're just a contractor. Um, did you know that wasn't his real name? Oh, I'm not convinced it's a real person either. What's his real name? Bob Raymond. Bob. Okay. We like that. Nice. More work. We're more work. We're doing more work for Bob, guys. Let's do it for Bob. Melon's a friend of Bob. I right, need to explode the pigs. It means, of course, we need to get to the pigs. Ooh. Um. Can I use this? 
this on a pig? I don't think it's actually going to be that helpful if I do, huh? I don't know. I feel like Robert is pretty wealthy sounding. Oh, wait. Is it going to force me to use this now? No, maybe not. Oh, but it did force me to use it in a way I didn't want. Same with this, actually. Yeah, we're certainly not going to win this one. This one's not even close. I think we mucked this one up. Actually, ah, we really are kind of getting a little close near the end. Huh. I didn't do it, guys. We didn't do it. Oops, that's not what I wanted to do. Restart, restart. Gotta get that shipping in. Oh yeah, this one's going better. No wonder you're not getting promoted. Oof. Oof. I wonder if like when you fail, it makes it easier. I think it does. I think like when you fail, it just gives you more bombs and stuff. Like it takes pity on you. Because the point of this game is not actually to match three, right? The point of this game is just like it's the story and everything. It's the relationships. It's the preaching. Pretty preachy game, that's okay. There was actually one level that I failed a couple times. Easy. I still don't want to talk to Leslie, so we got to do another job. Nobody to to talk to. So I guess we're supposed to get a bunch of rockets here. I don't know. progress yet. Looking kind of doomed. Once we find out they're chicks, then we're really just supposed to potion all the chicks. I see. It's probably too late now, though. That's what we were supposed to do. Well, now it's easy because we know they're chicks. 
We probably did find that out a little earlier. But I just didn't notice in time. And it should have been a little obvious in retrospect that that was really the only logical... Logical solution to this puzzle. Was that it would be that. Alright, let's finish another day. We've been working here for 20-something years. Oh, now we're shipping rabbits. I'm sure after this day, we're going to go home, see our daughter's going away party. She's going to go off to college, and we're going to be working here for another 10 years. And we're going to eventually retire and die. That's probably how this game's going to end, with us just dying. Alone. Yeah, that's the kind of game this is, Winja. <laughs> well, we're supposed to be taking care of the garden. But our wife doesn't want that. So I don't know. Maybe if my character too, gets too bored and chat up with his ex-girlfriend that wanted to wanted to start something a while back but I said no I was responsible all right finish the task for today Charlie, I'm done. This is my AI boss. It used to be an older guy, but he got fired and replaced by a computer. Finished all my tasks, Charlie. Before you go, Charlie has been informed that communication about our new employment contract was a bit one-sided. In an effort to improve mutual understanding, we have arranged an opportunity for you to talk to your local union representative. We have a union? There's no way we have a union, not a real union. It's your right to do so. I, I, I almost guarantee, I almost guarantee that my local union representative is Charlie, an AI designed and working for the company. Almost guarantee that's my AI. Would you like to do so? Yeah, of course. Hello, this is Charlie, your local union rep. This is a trap. Yeah, I'm too stupid. I'm too naive, guys. The, at this sort of corporation, everything that this corporation has done. <laughs> you probably don't want to even say the U word here. Honestly, if this guy gets fired, it's going to be a blessing at this point. Well, I don't know why he's still working there. It's a terrible company. They treat you like garbage. They treat everyone like garbage. You're not making a difference. You're not happy. You've been miserable. You've been working here for 25 years, 30 years. I don't even know how long, 35, whatever, how long it's been. The hell, it's you again. Well, yes. Since President McBurger came into power, unions have unfortunately been banned. <laughs> Yeah, the president has a sponsor now. <laughs> oh, man. Jokey Jokey's always on the side of the working class and has granted Charlie full rights to listen and appear sympathetic. I can't live with the same old wage and with all the new costs now that I don't have insurance. That's really unfortunate. Maybe you could take multiple jobs. What a nice opportunity to grow and be even more successful. I hardly have any free time as it is, Charlie. Charlie's sure you can always squeeze a pizza delivery here and a taxi ride there. If you really put your head into it, you can do anything. Can we quit? I don't think our character has the balls. 
Our daughter's going to college. We're not going to be able to pay for college if we quit. Nah, she can just take out $100,000 in student loans, right? I'm sure it'll be worth it. <laughs> it's community college for you, honey. <laughs> I quit. Charlie knows you won't do that. Where would you go? Jokey Jokey AI division has analyzed the local employment market and knows as well as you do that this is your only employment opportunity. Do you want some overtime? I have to go to my daughter's party. Let me go. All right. Time to go hang out with our daughter and our family. More pleasant dreams coming right up. All right. So before we answered be a good employee so we could climb the ranks so we could take down the company by leaking an article but the newspaper got bought by the company and they shut it down so there's no reason for us to be honest they're not gonna they're not gonna fire us anyway let's just troll their response I'm not the best version of myself Do I have a greater purpose? I don't even know what that means. Do I have a right to be happy? Yeah, and you're not helping. Alright, any ideas on what this actually is? I just interpreted it as my character dreaming. But I don't know. There's weird numbers and stuff behind my camera. It's quite possible that my own character is not even real. Pretty sure the CEO isn't real. Oh my goodness. 13896. I have worked for this company for 38 years, guys. 38 years I've worked for this company. This is uh ten years after the last one. Ten years after my my first child went to college. It's been 10 years since the last day. Been working at this company for 38 years. I tried to quit, but I'm old. People don't. Ageism is a real thing, even though companies uh, try to say they don't do it. And uh, this. Uh, this world that I live in is not a very good one. Now let's see what continues next in this guy's happy life. Message of the day. A cheap brown car has been seen parked in space 23A. This is a management level parking space. If the car is not removed in 10 minutes, authorities will be notified. Have a lovely day. Hello, welcome to your new working day at Jokey Jokey. You seem a little different, Charlie. Charlie's fully operational. Change log version 7.69. Turned off the emotional core. The NN solution appears to always converge on being empathetic towards the commoners. Bug 1436545. We cannot seem to find a solution to the problem despite numerous iterations, so the management ordered the emotional core to be turned off. 
got rid of the legacy string library by Jack by writing my own much improved version, updated company policy charts, and fixed typos. So in other words, this AI now is more computer-like and less nice. What's going on, Charlie? Please refrain from idle chit chat. This channel's for work issues only. Wow. It's been 38 years since we started. We've had the same CEO this whole time. Um, he says that the reason why he still is alive is because uh, he's so rich that he's just paying for stuff to keep him young. Hello, Richard. Or should I say Bob? Oh, now he's been frozen in cryo sleep. Oh, we can give me a couple neurons. I can talk to the founder. 3%? That's pretty good. How does it feel to be frozen, Bob? You suck, Bob. Yes. How wonderful for... He's not listening to me. You don't even know my name, Bob. What is it? I'm employee number 3242678. Is that my name? You're as delusional as ever, Popsicle. I like popsicles. It's like I'm talking to dork. <laughs> My neurons are required elsewhere. All right. Bye-bye, Richard. Let's get to work, guys. Kill all the rabbits. Waskily rabbits. Got it. Killing things over there does not help me. But sometimes it is the only thing to do. firework or a bomb or something to kill that thing. Great. Oh my word. This looks wacky. Is this not just really easy? Oh, I guess you can't do it forever. Six on each side and one in the middle. So we're going to need bombs. Silence is golden. If you still feel the need to scream, call the HR department. 777-3782. Should we call HR? 3782 is the extension. That sounds kind of fun. Can we get this to the bottom? OK, 
can't be worse than talking to Charlie. Yeah. Huh. Yeah, because there's no actual pigs and rabbits falling. They so basically just gotta clear things until you get more rockets and stuff. Oh, wait. We're out. Failed. Was it 3782? Hey, there it is. They jar. It's the first HR department in the world to operate on ultra modern self service basis. Great. I want to retire. Why don't you sleep on it? I'm a sad and tired person once to retire to a life of nothing. I'm a simpleton and I will retire now to a life of nothing. Goodbye, traitor. Oh, uh, what's going on, guys? Wait. We did it? There's no number down here this time. And yes, the music does sound like that. That's not a stream bug. Wait, what happened? I thought... Nothing ever happens when I call those lines. Is it the end of the game? Run completed? Am I... Wait, am I supposed to play this game again? Sixty-three percent efficiency? What's my... What's a TF rate? Truth-false rate? This is like my, my, my questionnaire stuff. Affinity is typical. Overtime? I only did one out of five overtimes. What's CL suitability? Highly promising candidate. Subject shows great performance metrics in all key areas. Excellent stability of the M and T curve. Much potential left in optimizing use of processing resources. But this is something to celebrate and a key example of our process, keeping this as our new baseline. Wait, am I a human or am I actually a computer? Now it's full screen. What? <laughs> what? <laughs> Wait. Day one.
Welcome to the family.